Hi. Hello. Howdy. Welcome back to Let's Play Shin Megami Tensei Persona 4. Do you ever do something incredibly stupid and you feel yourself do it and you're like, wow, that was really stupid? Because I did something really stupid. Remember how I was going to fuse Ghoul into something to make Ipandatara? In fact, we can see right now, it was not a Taishi to make Ipandatara. While I was grinding, I got rid of Nata Taishi and replaced it with Lilum. And because I'm like, oh, this is the, the lowest level persona I have, I don't need it. And then I ended up having to resummon Nata Taishi. I feel like a total fucking fool about it. It wasn't even a big, like, money loss. It was only 2,000 yen, which isn't that much considering how much I have right now. Uh, after grinding, I should say. But it's still, like,. I still feel very foolish about it, you know what I mean? So, whatever. Anyways, the point is, now I can make Iban Datara, and I can get Tsukukaja on it. And guess what? That's gonna solve one of Margaret's requests. Hooray. Getting Ghoul to level 10 was not very difficult at all, either, so... Definitely one of the easier ways to do things. I'm sure there's probably like a thousand different ways you can get Tsukukaja on Iban Datara, But, this was the most convenient for me. I think this is my first time making Ipan Datara anyway, so it's also going to be nice just to, like, have it added, so. Uh, I also hit level 20, so that means now I have more Persona, like, space, as you've noticed, so. Anyways, let's talk to Margaret. Margaret's request. Fuck off. What? I have to leave and come back now, because she'll be like, oh my god, you have it. I didn't think you would have it. Welcome to the Velvet Room. And Ipan Datara with Tsukukaja. You have successfully completed the quest. Well-rounded, flexible, muscular, splendid. You've done good work here. You are indeed the one with the infinite potential. Or just infinite potential. Because it's not the infinite. It's, it's, it's a non-specific... Uh, what's the word... Ah, fuck. I, if I was still t taking, like... If I was still in school, I would know. Indefinite. Indefinite. Whatever. Uh, chuckle. Now I'm even more curious about you. Margaret is smiling gently and became a little more intimate. And Igor's right there the whole time. Whatever. It doesn't matter, because like I said, I can't even make an Empress Persona yet, I don't think. So, whatever. I just want to get this out of the way. What's next, baby girl? Matador with Mahama. I don't think I can make Matador yet, so we're not going to worry about it. But now that I can get rid of Ipan Datara, what can I make with you? Oh, I can make something in the Empress, but... Do I want to make something in the Empress? This is really the question. The problem is, Jack Frost is so fucking good right now, the only thing I would realistically want to replace it with is something in the Strength Arcana. Because that's the only thing that would really catch up to me. And to be fair, Rakshasa could be pretty good. Uh, so that's definitely an option. But yeah, otherwise, uh, the only other thing I'd want to make is something in the Magician Arcana. So unless, like, we're getting something good here. Uh, let's make Anubis, clearly. Actually, eh, Phoenix is pretty good for this point in the game. Uh, yeah, I, and I think Phoenix is going to be good for the next boss, spoilers, so... Definitely a little tempting, I won't lie to you. Unfortunately, I don't remember what Phoenix can learn. Fortunately, though, I have the guide open. And the guide can tell me what Phoenix will learn. Uh, okay, Shin Megami Tensei, where's Persona 4? Oh my god, is Persona 4 not here? What the fuck? It doesn't list Persona 4 stats? I hate fandom so fucking much. Ugh. Yeah, it just, it does Persona 2 and then it just doesn't have Persona 3 or 4. I guess to be fair, I don't think this is in Persona 3, but... Wow, Phantom, you are so fucking useless. I fucking hate you. Phantom, you are a piece of shit and I hope you rot in hell. This is in the first five minutes of my YouTube video, by the way. 
No, but really, like, what's the fucking? I just want to see what else it learns. God damn it. Okay, fine. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna make a new tab. Persona for Phoenix. I just want to know if it's worth investing in. Uh, can I just see what it learns? Oh my god. Why must life be so fucking difficult? Skills. Uh. This is Persona 4 Golden. Golden is not the same. You know, whatever. I have to assume Golden is going to be the same then. That's super annoying. Whatever. Uh, so Twin Shock, Growth 1, Dodge Eyes, Fire Beast, Moragian. You know, I'm not actually that interested. I thought you would learn Media or something. I mean, I don't need Media anyways, but... Yeah, I can hold out for a better persona anyways. Fuck this. Uh, yeah. Can I make anything here? I can make Vitala, but why would I want to make Vitala? Fucking. <laughs> Let's make Vitala, sure. For, for, for what? For what? Well, I mean, yeah, okay, whatever. Alright, that was, that was fun. In real, but not real fun. Uh, I forgot to check the fusion forecast. Let me pull that up. Today is the 22nd. Nothing! There's no reason to do that. And there's really nothing good in terms of, like, fusion forecast for a while. So we're not going to worry about it. Uh, also, I paid the fox to get everyone to full SP. Uh, though by everyone, I mean just Yosuke. I still have 10,000 yen, too, so I'm happy with that. Uh, let's drop a save now, I guess. I'm feeling like SP management, management, if I could talk. Uh, I feel like it's not going to be nearly as difficult as I worried it is. Uh, mostly because I feel like you could just go to Yuhiko's castle and grind up money. Until you can fucking recover all your SP. And then, you know, later in the game you get an even quicker way of recovering your SP. That involves Yuhiko's castle, so... Honestly, it's, it's starting to feel like this game is not going to be difficult. If anything, the most difficult part is probably just going to be, like, meeting the deadlines. Oh, well. If I can make it past this next boss, that's really the last, like, difficulty spike. Because, uh, spoilers, this next boss is a son of a bitch. This place is really steamy. So why do I feel a chill down my fuzzy spine? Oh, yeah! Okay, I'm done. I think I gotta call my young kill me you. Okay. Okay, I'm done. I'm done with you. So, yet again, it's another dungeon. I do kind of like the music here, though. It's it's actually good, unlike Yukiko's Castle. God, I can't fucking stand Yukiko's Castle's music. It's so fucking nothing to me. Speaking of nothing, do you want to turn around? I know I probably spent just as much time in Persona 3 waiting for Shadows to turn around. I felt like I had, like, a fucking flicker of, like, agency about it. Because I was mashing start. Anyways, monopolizing Cupid. You are we to ice. Hey, Chie. Chie. I'm going to use you. Um, actually, I don't need to use Chie immediately. I, I don't need to use her SP immediately, I mean. Yeah, I could, uh, I could do this. Cool. And, oh, you move immediately? What do you mean? What? Okay, I should have used Chie's SP, but whatever. She's only gonna have to use Bufu. And oh, I was hoping for a follow-up attack. Um, let's just do this. Fuck it. Boom. Wow, marked jump in experience in yen from my grinding sessions. I gotta say. Really, the name of the game here is just gonna be using as little SP as possible to make it through all these encounters. Which sounds pretty obvious. Uh, oh yeah, I just realized. I forgot to show that I got all the items from uh, from the request. I should do that uh, after this fight. So here's a autonomy. Auto 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 Why can I not say this? Autonomy. 
I can say Autonomous. Miss. Autonomic, for whatever reason, will throw me off. Uh, Autonomic Basalt. It is week two win. The Basalt, uh, I don't know if this uh, this Basalt is specifically like this, but in general, I think this enemy type is in a weird position where, like, it takes less damage from, uh, from a lot of attacks. It takes more damage from being hit by something. So I'm going to try and show that off right now. Because I think if I do an all-out attack, it's not going to do much to it. I'm only doing this for the demonstration purposes, by the way. Oh no, it does kill it. Okay. I guess the next base salt that we're gonna run into is like that. Cause uh I know Yeah, okay, I can see. Uh the next base salt resists Almighty, so that's why. Okay. I spoke too soon. Forgive me. Forgive me for my, my foolish error of misspeaking about a video game. Anyways, uh let me pull up my items. So where is it? I have excuse me. Where, 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 where are these items? Uh, okay, here we go. Angel statue, demon statue, Ritz wire. I was that it? Was that all I needed? Well, obviously Mori ran Maru too. Uh, I might have needed one more thing. I feel like I might have. Uh, let's see. Demon statue and uh, oh, desk refurbishing. Shit, I forgot to do this one. Ah, I could do it off screen. I mean, it's not a big deal. I could just fucking. Like, whatever. I'm glad I checked, because I would have been very annoyed at myself if I tried to turn that in. Why did you turn around immediately? Whatever. Oh, uh, what do you mean you move first? Oh, uh, what do you mean? Okay. She is moving next. We're not going to take any risks here. We're just going to Mabufu and call it a day. I mean, that is explicitly what she is SP is for. What do you mean you missed? Oh, okay. It's down. Good. Ah, whatever. Unfortunately, this is gonna be a situation where I do have to clear out the entire dungeon in one day, and this this boss fight is. Uh, uh, a mother of a fuck, let's say. Also, high enemy that's gonna be hard. I feel like getting some experience and and money though. Fuck, I thought you were turning the other way. Stop that. What are you? Are you you get to school king? No, you're the dice. Iron dice. Uh you're way too electric, shocker. I don't like that you're moving next though. Someone else's turn. Yeah, see the dice kinda just do nothing. Uh, I just want to make sure I don't attack it while it's having a turn. Okay, I, I realistically shouldn't have to do this, but I want to cover my bases. Awesome! Okay. I don't want to attack this one now because it's going to, like, freak out if I do. Uh, this sucks. Stop, don't do anything. Hey. Okay. Now let's attack this one, fuck it. There we go. We got this, we got this. Easy! Fucking easy. Okay, I want the all out attack, so I will use EO. I probably shouldn't have, but whatever. Cause if it, if it gets up, if it gets up it's using sacrifice and it's doing a shitload of damage. I don't want to risk it. So, yeah, I just, I don't want to take the risk. I would have liked to get shuffle time, though. Perhaps I could have been free. Revival bead, that's nice. I got a revival bead in Hiko's Castle, too, so now I'm sitting at five revival beads. Very, very, very comfortable place to be for me right now, so... Cool, it's the stairs. Um, not gonna lie to you guys, I kind of want to book it to the stairs first. I want to make it to, to, to the the boss fight first, like just to make sure I'm not like burning my SP and spinning my wheels. I'll revisit floors if I need to grind. So hmm, we haven't come across this kanji coon yet. Oh yeah, Sensei, can I ask you something? Why is it so steamy here? Okay, okay, I don't, whatever. 
Teddy, you have opinions. Feel free to say them. Oh god, okay. You know what, let's just move. I'm not explicitly trying to dodge enemies, but... I am trying to be smart. Ah, fuck your mother. How did you get the advantage? Oh, this is bad. Uh, don't get GA, don't get GA, don't get GA, don't get GA. Wow, you guys suck. Okay, that's what I get for saying you suck. Okay. Asshole. Yeah, Yosuke sucks, I know. Who needs Yosuke for the all out attack? Am I right? Who needs them? Hey, shuffle time. Maybe I'll actually get to show off Arcana Chance. I don't think I've gotten a chance to do that. Hooray, Oberon. Hey, Arcana Chance. So, Arcana Chance. I don't think I've explained it. Also, I don't think Tower is very good. In terms of, like, the risk. Uh, so, Arcana Chance is the thing where, like... Uh, after every random encounter, you, if you, or shuffle time rather, you have a chance of activating it where one of the, however many arcanas, I think it's like 22, will appear, and it can, if you play roulette, it can land up either upright or upside down. If it's upright, then you get a good bonus. If it's, de if it's the other side, then you get a bad, like, something bad happens to you. Actually, no, tower I think is a good one, if I recall correctly. You received extra treasure from a treasure chest for a while. Chest grant extra money. Uh, all treasure chests will contain shadows for a while. I will take this risk. Because this is... This just means I don't have to open treasure chests. Come on. Come on! Yeah! Nice! Upright tower. That is exactly what I want. Sweet. So yeah, that's just how Arcana Chance works. It's completely random. Uh, nothing you do impacts it. Uh, so, you have to, you have to recognize that if you do Arcana Chance, you have to be prepared to face whatever negative consequence you may potentially get. Uh, you know, it's, it's like, it's like gambling. Never bet money you can't afford to lose. <laughs> never, never do an Arcana Chance you can't afford to, to, to fail. Uh, that's a treasure chest right there. Um, okay, I would prefer to not risk losing my... Uh, tower bonus, but I have to kill you to get to it. There wasn't another treasure chest earlier, so yeah. Problem is, you're in the way, so it's like... Arcana chances that are bonuses like this, where it's like, after a while, or, uh... uh for a while, you'll have this bonus. They do fade after you do enough fights, or... Or if they activate enough, so I'm kind of wary about that, but... Hopefully this fight won't, like... Do that. Hey, look! It's a pig! Bribe Fuzz, uh, you are weak to darkness, which is bad, because I don't have Mudo. Actually, doesn't, uh, doesn't Ipan Datara have Mudo? He does. Um, I'm gonna just, I'm just gonna make my life easier to do this. Mudo. Yeah, I don't want to take risks. It's a lot of SP, but I want to play safe. Because taking damage is also a lot of SP to recover. And since I can grind for money, I'm a little bit less wary to use SP now. You didn't drop anything, you motherfuckers. Whatever. Uh, okay, give me give me that reward. Also, before I forget, let me re-equip Jack Frost. Because Jack Frost is definitely the better persona of the two. Obtain one chest key, nice, and 7,200 yen, that's a lot of fucking money, bro. Jesus. I didn't think you'd be giving me that much money, fuck, look, that's like, I just got like, uh, 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 just, so I went from 14,000 to 2,100, uh, or 14,000 to 21,000, so that was like a 50% increase in money. That is nice. Okay, uh, uh, which way are you going, bro? Go over here. Go over here. Oh, no. Oh, no. You missed me. Now you've got to kiss me with tongue. I really just want to book it to treasure chest right now. I wonder, does it apply for... Oh. I see something. Okay. 
chest. I think it's probably going to expire after either another treasure chest or it, or a second. Like, after one or two more treasure chests, it'll probably expire. So I want to make the most of it now. Uh, also, I just... I want to open that treasure chest because it could be a really good piece of armor. And unique armor is always nice. You motherfucker. I hate when they get the advantage. It doesn't feel like they should sometimes. Oh, you son of a bitch. Oh yeah, you have dodge physical. I forgot about that. I definitely want to uh, use Media with uh, Yuki Actually, I think I'll just do it after this fight. Actually, no. I'll wait till either her or Yosuke takes damage. I don't want to be too, like, willy-nilly with her SP, because she's... Okay, good. Uh, she's the one that will cost me the most if she loses SP. Yeah! That's exactly the armor I wanted. Oh my god. And I got 88,000 or 8,800 yen. Okay, that was so good. So that was like uh, 15,000 yen right there. That's awesome. Uh, cool. So now let's see what Jingifu does. Uh, yeah? It's, it's, it's worse. It's worse. Okay, it's worse. I was really wanting a unique armor, and it's worse. I mean, the evasion's better in 10 HP, but, like, I'd rather take the, the 6 defense and strength. Oh, okay, whatever. I mean, it's gonna sell for a decent amount, so it's just, like, money. On top of the money we're getting from the tower. Oh, God! I didn't realize you were right there, bro. Whatever. I mean, even bad stuff from Treasure Chest is usually nice, because you can sell it, so... Where's the shadow? I literally... Oh my god. I just wanted to see where it was so I could... Oh. Oh. It's like stuck. Uh... You know what? I can get... Ah, oh, god damn it! I got stuck. I got like caught on an edge. Oh, this is bad. Oh, okay. This is... This is... This is bad. Um... Someone finish it off. You know, mm, you know what? Fuck it. I will stay. I can't see what skills you have. I... Yeah, let's stay. Fuck it. I want to take risks. If there's only one left, I can kill you with the one rush. Okay. Yeah, let's just do this. Stop missing. All right, now we need to use Medea. Whatever. Whatever. That's what I get for fucking up. Uh, okay, I want Illigor, and I want Illigor bad. Right. What are we getting rid of? Uh, let's get rid of Fornius, because I already have it on Dothra anyways. Right. Another tower. Okay, Emperor. I don't think is worth it. There's uh, when you get Arcana Chance, there's ones that can raise your stats. If I recall correctly, Emperor is one of those? Actually, maybe not. Uh, Emperor temporarily grants consistent player advantage. Uh, temporarily grants it to consistent enemy advantage if you get it wrong. I can't take that risk. I really can't afford to take that risk. I would love... Like, okay, I would love to do that, but... It's like I said earlier, don't, don't play an Arcana chance you can't afford to take the, the negative of. You know, like, I could have taken the negative of the tower one. I can't take the negative there. Because that would just make me so much more... That would just take so much more resources. And it's not worth it. For what what, what I'm gaining out of that is not worth it. So, no. Yeah. Uh, is there an easy treasure I can get over here? Um... Potentially. I think it's worth it. I think it's worth it. Can I get the advantage? Nice. See, if I had gotten the negative on the Emperor, that would not have been an advantage anymore. That would have 100% still been, uh, you can't move. Like, the enemy gets the advantage. Which is why you can't risk it. Or why I couldn't risk it, I guess. Uh, yeah, get a crit so that way we can get a follow-up. Ah, I wanted the follow-up. Oh, 
That's still good, though. Uh, I just gotta make sure this guy's not going next. Okay, yeah, we're good. Cool, no SP used. Yeah, I don't need to use Mudo on that guy if I ha on the that encounter if I uh, if I start with the advantage. That's good. Okay, and treasure box is locked. Sure. Snow Vow. Ah, that's not very good. Uh, Snow Vow, it's like Thunder Vow, but with ice. And Chie doesn't really want it. Increases ice damage. Eh. I mean... I know this sounds silly, but the two agility is honestly more useful to me. Because I'm only using her Bufu for knockdowns. I'm not using it for damage, so... If anything, I want it. I want it, because I have Bufu left. And also, if they're done, yeah, fuck this. I'll take it. Because if I could use Bufula or Mabufu, that's doing some serious damage, so. Might as well. I mean, I don't really need Thunder Val anyway. I'm only using Zeo for knockdowns. Whoa, I just got Goosebumps. Something's on this floor. Be careful. I love how I'm not even trying to do Teddy's voice. Oh, God. That's how they, they just keep sneaking up on me. Do I have to go down to reset your AI? I totally do, don't I? Whatever. It's fine. I'm not owned. Just uh, being really patient and careful with this with this dungeon. Like I said, if I can make it through this dungeon, the rest of the game will be cake. Like, for real, so. Because I was joking before when I said that. I there we go. And what are you? Oh, it's you guys. Daring Gygus. Uh, you're weak to win and you resist. F or, uh, you're strong against Fizz. Whatever. I give a fuck. Um. I probably should roll for crits, but right now I kind of want to save myself the time. I really do. Fuck this. It'd be nice if Chie's follow-up attack activated, though. Ah, I thought it was about to, to be honest. Whatever. I also don't know if these guys have any form of counter, so... It's probably not worth risking it. I'd rather just roll the victories. Well, that's easy. Hooray, I got Obarian. I don't know. I guess I'll get rid of Lulum because I just got it. I registered it with Margaret. Uh, and I, I still do technically need Valkyrie. Uh, yeah, fuck it. What are kind of chance are we looking at? Emperor again? No, I'm, I, I see you, devil. I'm not doing it. I'm not taking that risk. <laughs> again, it's very useful if you get it, but I just can't afford... I can't afford to pay the debt it could incur me, so. Alright, this presence. This is a perfect time to split the segment, by the way, so I'm gonna do that right now. Oh my god, the presence. Could it be Kanji-kun? Open the door and enter? Well, of course. I really don't want to have to talk about this, but we're going to have to. As a bisexual man, I have opinions, and I don't want to have to share them. But I also know I have to. At last, I've penetrated the facility. These images are coming to you live from inside this steamy paradise. But I've yet to have any charming encounters. Could this hot fog be the cause? It's like steam rising from sweat. Mm, my body's tingling with excitement. Yep. Crap. This is so wrong in so many ways. What's wrong about homosexuality, Yosuke? Please speak up. I'm going to wish you real so I could choke you dead. I hate Yosuke. Anyways. 
remember it being kind of like this on Yukiko's show, too. No, it wasn't like this. <laughs> uh, those voices again. Wait, are, are they louder this time? These voices? I was wondering whose they could be since it's only the victim in here. Is it the people watching outside? You mean everybody who's watching the Midnight Channel? They're reacting to the show? Yikes! If people are watching Kanji-kun now, he's gonna be a legend in a way he never intended. Yikers! Well, it's really his shadow, not him. But normal people won't know that. The shadows are getting really restless. This does create the question, could people watching the Midnight Channel see us as well? That would also make me question, like, if they can't, what are they seeing when we're on the screen with Kanji? And then, if they can, how come it never becomes a plot point? But whatever. That elusive thing I truly yearn for. Will I finally find it here? <laughs> well then, onward and deeper to reach further realms of romance. Let's get going, damn it! Okay. Kanji kun. That was his other self. It's trying to reveal his hidden feelings. It seems much worse than that time with Yuki chan's shadow. At this rate, it might end up getting bare naked. <laughs> time and place. Time and place. Bare naked? Oh man, here it comes. Um, was I supposed to laugh? <laughs> Anyways. Let's move on. If I'm not mistaken, this floor's exit or stairs is around the left, I want to say. I think this leads to treasure. But I'm always in the mood for treasure, so. Oh no, shadows! Oh. Oh! I didn't realize one of them was following. Wait, it didn't get the advantage. That was a jump scare to me. But uh, it didn't get the advantage, but also... I don't like the situation because pursuing Pesque is... Uh, I don't know if it's pronounced Pesque or just Pes, but whatever. Uh, it's it's Wita Hama. I don't have Hama. Actually, I have Archangel. I think I have Archangel, but... Oh, no. Stop it! Stop it! Yosuke scared. Yeah, well, he could, he could. You know what? You know what? This is a perfect time. Let's use Rampage. Rampage is a multi-hit. Uh, uh, it hits everyone skill, and this would be a really good opportunity to show it off. Hey, it's getting a crit. So let's watch this. Nice double crit. Oh my god, that was. That's a lifesaver of a fucking crit, like, situation. So yeah, this is where Chie really shines. Uh, have, Rampage is going to do a lot for us in this dungeon. I want to be conservative with using it, though. Because obviously it does have a high HP cost for this point in the game. Well, not super high, but it's also like... You want to be careful with it, is what I'm getting at, so... Unfortunately, this guy is going to be moving next, and I don't really have a good way to deal with him. Just kidding, I do. Because he's weak to you, Guru. Oh, no, I was looking at the wrong one. Shit. Oh, fuck my life. I looked at the wrong one, and he got dizzy, and I... And the spaghetti. Whatever. Um... Okay, let's use Media again. Just to be safe. I kind of regret using that Guru, and I feel like a fucking fool about it. Stop using double fangs. I'm pissed now. One enemy. 
Okay. If my effort to use less SP, I'm probably using more SP. But it's all it's all good. Who cares? I mean, the fox at this point is going to be genuinely helpful. Because, I, like I said, I could just grind my eyeballs off out off screen and get money to to, to deal with it. So. Hooray! We're level 21 now. Hooray! You leveled up and it doesn't matter. Why is endurance your highest stat? What the hell? Whatever. Cool. Having Aguila will be nice, but in theory, but in execution, it, it I don't want to use it because it'll be so like it's too good to use. But whatever. In Battle Camisole. Hello, Chie. Chie, you want that? Yeah, you do. Uh, yeah, you want that. I'm sorry. Having Evade Fire Medium is nice, but I like this defense so much more. So, yeah. That was a very nice reward. Thank you so much. Uh, is there anything over here? No. Okay. So maybe there's a key over to the left, and then I run back over here to unlock the door, maybe? Potentially? Okay. Ah, uh, these guys again? I don't like these guys. They're very annoying to deal with. Um... Yeah, these guys actually really fucking suck to deal with. Because they do a lot of damage to you. You know what, I'm... You know, no balls, I admit it. No balls. They're just, they're gonna do too much damage. I really don't want to deal with it right now. Oh, hi! That was a very nice critical. Yeah, I don't care, though. Sorry. I just, these guys are, they mean business, they have no weakness, I don't want to deal with them right now. They're too much effort, like they're too much resources to deal with, relative to the reward that they give, which is not enough. If they were like, oh, if they gave like more experience and money, I would consider it, but as is now, nah. Nah, bro. Um, this, this floor is going on a bit longer than I'd like, I'm gonna be honest with you. Hey look, it's you guys. Whatever. You get to go first. Honestly, having that 40 extra SP is really helping Yosuke out right now. I'm shocked I still haven't gotten Chie's follow-up attack yet. It's starting to feel like I just like I'm I'm just not gonna see it. Whatever. Um, I guess Titan. Let's go for Titan. Arcana chance? Give me Arcana chance after this. Uh, also, eh. Uh, since it's a strength one, I can get rid of uh, Valkyrie. Arcana chance? Don't be Emperor. Okay, Moon. I remember Moon being really good. What is Moon? Uh, you'll gain more experience from a battle for a while. You'll gain less experience from battle for a while. I can afford to take that. I can afford to take that. That is 100% a risk I'm willing to take. It will be bad, but I want to take the risk. Yeah! Nice! Because, like, even if you lose all experience, you're still getting money. So battles are still kind of worth it. And experience isn't the end of the world. That said, getting more experience is very fucking nice, so... Yeah. God, this place is so much bigger than I remembered. Uh, okay, that's the stairs. I'm kind of curious. I want to see what's over there now. I guess you just unlock the door by going to the other side, but whatever. Just like the chicken crossing the road. <laughs> So if I'm fighting the Nizam beast now, it's definitely worth it. Okay. Um, I'm gonna use Rampage again. Fuck it. Call the cops. I don't give a fuck. Someone else's turn. Actually, I feel like I don't need to. These guys aren't taking hits very well. Okay, that was that was a misread. 
do they resist fire at all? Because now I need to, like... Yeah, now I need to get in front of this. Uh... They don't resist fire. Mm -hmm. You know what? No, let's take the risk. Let's be risky. Let's be Jonesy. Let's be Jonesy. Cool, it's just one? Okay. And he's only using Evil Touch. I don't care. That was fine. That was totally worth it. Cool. The risk paid off. Do, do, boom. Look at that experience. Oh, I love it. Unfortunately, the problem with physical attacks in this game is that when you have people like Chie learning multiple physical moves, they kind of become redundant because there's no pierce, there's no slash, there's no strike. It's all the same physical element. So now when Chie learns Assault Dive, I'm like, who gives a shit? You have Rampage. That's the only physical move I would ever want to use on you right now besides maybe Skullcracker. I guess to be fair, Assault Dive is better than Skullcracker, but... What I'm getting at is that she she's gonna learn a lot of unnecessary physical attacks, and it's just like for what? Whatever. Okay, this I'm 100% willing to do the fight on because I can kill it. I can kill it. If it does double things, what the fuck ever. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, that wasn't even that much. Come the fuck on! Stop missing. Life caller, hooray. And okay, moon still applied. Is there nothing here? Okay, good. Oh, three chest key. Cool. I knew there was something good over here. I'm so glad I actually bothered. Because three chest keys is really nice. It's kind of a shame I had to sell those chest keys at the beginning of the let's play. <laughs> cause cause I would have liked to have some. I guess. I, I do have whatever you know what I mean okay, I'm not bothering with you at this point I should just make a break for the stairs how many go homes do I have uh, if I could check that'd be nice I have four okay I can use them pretty liberally but I don't want to if I can avoid it I also have a lot of vanish balls I need to remember that I have vanish balls so that way if I'm in a bad situation I can uh, also I'm going the wrong way but uh, yeah, if I'm in a, if I'm in a bad situation, I can pop a bit a vanish ball, because I have plenty of them. I got a lot from Yukiko's castle, surprisingly. I would have expected a Trofuri gem to be pretty fucking rare, but I guess not. Can I not unlock it? Okay, whatever. It's not the end of the world or anything, but I mean, you'd think. Your voice is from somewhere. A man can't back down in a time like this. Just watch. I'll show you how manly Kaji Tetsumi can be. Alright. How much money do I have? 34,000. I could probably get a, a refill from Fox if I really wanted to. Hey, look, it's Nice and Beast. Guess what I'm not fighting? The beauty of running away from them is that it just deletes them. It's just like, oh, you're gone. <laughs> you know, I don't have to waste resources. I just delete them from the field and I move on like normal. Oh, hi. Well, we're not fighting you. This is the, the beauty of being a little bit, like... I'm not overleveled, but, like, having grinded previously, I can, like, now dodge enemies and safely, like, say, okay, I'm still gonna be fine on levels for the most part. So. Daring Gygus. Uh, sure, whatever. But they're too slow. It's you, who's low? Yeah, whatever. Oh, you fucking... Yes, finally! Okay, Chia's follow-up attack is Galactic Punt. This is an extremely good follow-up move, because this is what it does. It just instantly deletes an enemy. It is so good. It is so stupidly good. Uh... I guess I should just roll for- In times of need, rely on Chie. I'm so sad that I'm probably not going to be using Chie in my final team. Who said that? Oh my god, who said that? <laughs> oh my god, what was that? Hey, anyways. But yeah, Chie is really good for early game. For, for Galactic Punt and Rampage. 
Just Galactic Punt and by itself is such a fucking, like... It is so convenient. I mean, it's not even... I don't even think it's, like, what I would say the best follow-up skill in the game is. But it's definitely up there. It's in contention of the title for me. So, yeah. The only real shame is that... <sighs> The only shame about it is that, like, you can't control who she's punting. So it, it would be so much better if you could say, Oh, I want you to punt this enemy versus this enemy. You know what I mean? But because you can't control it, it's like, you're kind of subject to whatever the AI determines. But, whatever. That's just the way it works. So anyways, uh, Nyz and Beast are being completely invalidated. Oh, okay. I kind of forgot the Moon Arcana was even in effect. I must confess. So, guess that's uh, that's on me. But whatever. Hey, look, stairs. Is there an easy treasure chest over here? Honestly, kinda. It's worth the roll. I think it's 100% worth that roll. Cause if it's a, if it's a, if I get the advantage, I can run away from it if it's something I don't want to fight. And if I don't get the advantage, I could get killed. So it's so worth it. I should check when the mini boss for this dungeon shows up. I want to say it's coming up. Probably on the next floor, to be honest. Uh, mini boss. Uh, no, it's on floor seven. That's weird. That's very weird, but whatever. Um, hi, Daring Gygus. I give a fuck. Okay, this time we're not gonna miss, Yosuke. Okay, Re say it with me. I'm not going to miss. It would be nice if I had Yukiko's follow-up attack just to maximize how many follow-up attacks I could get at any given time. But you can only have it so perfectly for so many ways. That was not a phrase that you say, but whatever. Why was that not an Arcana chance? Or shuffle time that could lead to Arcana chance? Explain that to me. Feminists. Treasure box is locked. What are we getting? Volt Suppressor. I don't love that. That's honestly not very good. Because it doesn't... I don't think it's helpful for you. Because Volt Suppressor reduces... Raises evasion rate to electric tax. Actually, no. Never mind. I thought that was something else. Okay. Raises evasion rate to physical tax. I'm going to take Volt Suppressor. Uh, that's actually more useful than I realized. I thought it was just like reduces... Uh, damage from electric attacks by 10% or something. But no, it raises evasion, which is much more relevant to my interests right now. Uh, a man's... A man's got this thing called pride. <laughs> I'll never lose. Hmm, it's no good. This seems getting worse, so I can't tell where Kanji Kun's at at all. Maybe it's already time for me to retire from being a guide. Yeah, maybe. Anyways. Uh... I kind of don't want to fight you if I can avoid you. Like I said, if I really need to grind, I'll, I can grind later. I will fight the enemies that I can't reliably dodge. Hello, dice. Two enemies. You can attack before them. Let's take the risks. I know the risks. And I'm apparently not very good at them. Whatever. I'm just trying to get a crit, man. Yeah, at this point, whatever. Okay, you're next, so I can attack you freely. Okay, let's do this. You're fucking kidding me. Yeah, you're right, Teddy. This isn't good indeed. Again, I'm, I, I don't want to take any risks with these motherfuckers. Hooray! So now... Hey look, a treasure chest. Ball Lightning, my favorite. Hey look, the stairs, also my favorite. 
This is a very easy floor. I'm cool with it. I'm used to the bathhouse, like, fucking obliterating me. Because this is, like... This is kind of harder than Yukiko's Castle in some ways, I would say. So... Gasp. This feeling, the other kanji's staring at us. Hey there, cutie pie. Are you trying to break the barrier of the acceptable just like me? No, since they came to rescue Kanji. Ooh. Does that mean you're yearning for me? Is that so? Oh, that makes me so happy. Well, then I simply must prepare something spectacular for you. I'm so looking forward to seeing you soon. Well, toodaloo. That's a hint that we're going to be seeing Shadow Kanji on the second, or the next floor. <laughs> it was the second floor. Uh, Sensei, this little bear is too scared to go on. Yeah, well, too bad. I'm a big bear, and I'm not scared to go on. So anyways, uh... These rooms really make it easy to dodge enemies, huh? This one, however, I need to wait on. I'm kind of sandwiched right now, so I gotta make sure this one doesn't detect me. Because if it does, I'm really fucked. Oh, of course you're approaching me! Okay, good. It's going back. I thought it was coming up this way for a second, and I was about to... I don't know. Not, not panic, but just, like, get mad. Get annoyed, I guess. Hey, look! More fucking dice! You know what? At this point, I kinda don't care. At this point, I just wanna speed it up. I don't wanna make any dumb mistakes and, like, deeply regret my decisions. So, let's just move on. I'm nearing the end of the segment anyway. Hey! What I'm probably gonna do is I'm probably gonna end up, uh... Stopping the segment once I get to the mini-boss. Cause I don't think I can fit the mini-boss fight into this segment. Which is a shame, but I'm definitely doing this this uh, dungeon quicker than I was expecting to. That's a lot of yen and money, or uh, yen and uh, experience, excuse me. Like I said, yen and money. Damn. Oh hey, Kuseth, I give a fuck. Thanks, Kuseth. I don't care. Hey, I actually care about this level up because Agila is gonna be nice. Hooray! And Recarm. I didn't know you learned Recarm this early. That's very convenient of you. Damn. Let's go down here, and... What's behind door number two? A load of nothing! I have to be careful here. Ah, shit. Oh, thank you for being stupid. Uh, this is probably gonna dead end. Yeah, I'm getting a dead end feeling from this, I must, I must confess. But we must soldier on. Okay, fuck you too. No, don't give me the fucking advantage. Oh, it's just dice. Who gives a shit? Doctor who gives a fuck, man. Man, I just I just don't care. You know, at this point, since it's like, fuck it. Might as well. Would've liked a galactic punt. Just saying. Just throwing that out there. Hooray. So now, please don't let this be a dead end. Please be the stairs. Oh, I always win. I'm always winning in this game. Okay, um, anything quick and easy down here? Quick and sleazy? How come there's always, like, a treasure chest whenever I want it? There's, like, like three out of four times I've checked, and there's been a- Oh god, oh god, oh god! This is not a drill! <laughs> okay, 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 let's try it one more time. But yeah, three out of four times I've checked the door, in a, like, adjacent to the stairs, and be like, I wonder if there's a treasure chest, and there has been. So... Honestly, it's kind of a shame the treasure chests have not been giving me very good stuff lately. Well, the, the locked ones, I should say. But, that's just the way it goes. Sometimes you win, sometimes- FUCKING CHRIST! I'm so fucked. Yeah, I knew it. Oh! Oh no, the 
this is bad. Oh, oh, thank God. Oh God. Okay. Um, we're 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 escaping. That is the primary objective now. Escape. Oh my God! Stop it. I don't care. We're escaping. Um, what is that hand? Dancing hand. It resists all elements. Okay. Can I just kill it so it doesn't do anything? Alright. Stop doing things! Stop doing things! Here, Medea. This was a very bad mistake, but mistakes have been made and we, we will survive, I think. Shut the fuck up and just find it, Tedward. Here, this thing's dead now. Two to go. We can do this. Come on, you still haven't found it? Oh, that's the price I pay for getting found. Crit? Someone there we go. Bye. There. Now's your chance to run. And I don't even get the experience from killing the hand. Sad day. Whatever. So what is Steel Panier? That's really the question I want answered. It's probably for you, Kiko. Uh... Um, yeah, it is for Yukiko. Yeah, char Charm Robe is nice, but... Mm... Actually, can I give it to someone else? No, it's only for girls, okay. Yeah, that's actually kind of... Mm... I don't know, actually. I don't... Mm... You know what it is for... It is for Yukiko. Who am I kidding? It is, it's more useful on Yukiko, I think. I, I think the one magic is worth the 20 SP trade. Unfortunately, actually, no, it's not. What am I saying? I don't think it is, actually. Like, it, it, the magic is always going to be useful. Having more defense is better. I, I just, I can't talk myself into this. I already have a lot of SP on, uh, on Yukiko. She's already my SP battery at this point. I don't need more SP. And there's not going to be a fight that's long enough where she's going to need more, so... Yeek, for some reason this floor is really steamy. Hang in there, guys. Wow, that's a shame, because I'm going to use a go home and leave. So, let's do that right now. Uh, excuse me. Go home. Go home. Uh, go home. Go home! There you are. Oh, man. And before I forget, I'm gonna, off-screen from this segment, I'm going to get the, uh, the thing I need from the, the desk. For desk refurbishing. Because I've already forgotten it once, and I don't want to forget it again, so. Uh, yeah. Let's see, just for shits and giggles, how much money this is gonna cost. Not that much, actually. That's a shockingly low amount. For rank 2? For rank 2. Wow. All right. Well, anyways, uh, that was the majority of Kanji's dungeon. We'll probably, uh, we'll almost certainly finish it next segment. Uh, so, yeah. Dungeon explorations are going way better than I was expecting them to before I started this Let's Play. I was most nervous about dungeon explorations being bad, and, like, they've been fairly tame so far. Maybe it's just because I've, like... I've played this game before, I know what I'm doing, and I'm also just generally better at video games than I was as a teenager. Who knows? Anyways, I will see you next time.